You must remember this A kiss is still a kiss Still a kid Tonight, I am at the Magic Kingdom, hanging out, riding some rides, and probably gonna eat some snacks. And it's a little bit cold out. So, let's go do this. Space Mountain is currently sitting at a 105 minute wait. I checked for a fast pass, but the only thing that they have open is Aladdin's Magic Carpets. So, probably not gonna do that. I'm gonna keep on checking the app to see if I can get a fast pass for something other than the Aladdin magic carpets. But it's around eight o'clock and the park closes at 11, so they are literally all booked up for tonight. All booked up. Just when I was about to give up, I kept on tapping that My Disney Experience app and you'll never believe it. I got myself a Winnie the Pooh pass. <laughs> but I hear happily ever after happening right now. just recorded those fireworks back here by Be Our Guest and the fireworks were hitting so hard that the camera was shaking. That is awesome. What a beautiful view. Now I want to ride something I have not done in a very long time. This beauty right here. I literally cannot remember the last time I rode this carousel but I really love it. It's a beautiful carousel. Look at it. Which one do we take? Oh, this one looks good. Oh, yes, I like him. Oh, but what about him? Oh, ho, ho. they're all really, really nice. I don't know. Oh. What do you guys think? Number 74? 
or should we go with number two? Oh, I like this big guy. <laughs> we weren't quick enough for the big guy. Oh boy, I'm like panicking. Okay, I found one right here. And I guess this is gonna be my steed for this evening right here. Let's take a selfie. We're gonna grab on tight. Oh, we're going. <laughs> there I am, you see me? <laughs> and how was your day today, sir? Going pretty well? Got a light load here. <laughs> oh. And I think we're coming to a stop. Oh, it looks like we got off the carousel just in time for the projection show. Oh, I want to see what it's like from here. You know what you're looking for, Zuri Eggman Lady? You know what you're going to find? That was actually pretty back there, but I still think the projections are best enjoyed staring directly in front of the castle. Just my opinion. So I know I said that there was going to be snacks and I really do need to eat. I'm actually starving, but there's not much to choose from. I'm over here in Liberty Square and there's not like any desserts or anything like that. Oh, I do know something I can get that I haven't had in a long time. And what I decided to get, the turkey leg. Wow, this is something that is like a staple that I have not had in a very, very long time. I am not even sure how I go about eating a turkey leg. It's been so long. I'm going to unwrap the paper, give you guys a good look at this bad boy. Oh, yeah, that is huge. $12.99. I guess I'm just going to... And a bite into it. isn't something you can just walk around the park and eat especially while you're trying to film something I'm gonna have to sit down or something Daniel, it's getting very Daniel's difficult like unfortunately I had to give up on the turkey leg it was way too much turkey leg and it's very difficult to eat an actual vlog at the same time so I decided to just throw out the rest and then maybe save a little room to get some dessert on the way out that sounds like a very good idea but first I want to go do Pirates of the Caribbean. Yo ho, yo ho, adventure land for me. But before I get to my journey on Pirates of the Caribbean, I wanted to pull over here and take a look at this beautiful courtyard they got here. This is just separate from the queue itself. Wow, it is so pretty over here, isn't it? Like, what do they even have this for? Just, just to have it? Look at that, so beautiful. I remember coming in here one time and taking photos and it was amazing during the day. Oh, I can smell it. <laughs> Nobody's here. I get to just peek around and look at things. How cool is that? Huh. A lesson I learned, if you ever ride Pirates of the Caribbean, avoid the outsides of the seats because that's where the water comes in. So I'm gonna sit directly in the middle.
you swamis, what may I offer for these hearty hands? Everyone an egg layer. Not lest they be laying golden eggs. That's the good stuff. I love me a little pirate. I love the smells. That's like the biggest thing I think. I don't know. As soon as I get a whiff of that, it just rushes back good memories. Now we do have about 10 minutes left until the park closes and from the way it looks over here looks like it's pretty dead. I think we're gonna try to go ride Big Thunder Mountain and hopefully get on without any weight. We can get a good look at the guys going to town on Splash Mountain up there under refurbishment if you guys didn't know. They're literally just tearing it apart, ripping it apart. What? The Florida weather is not too nice to shingles and roofs and stuff like that. So that's why it's important that Disney keeps up on the refurbishments here. And I, that's a little bit why Disney is so magical. That's how I feel. Oh yeah, Big Thunder Mountain. I am so excited. Oh, and it looks like it's just about a walk on. Well, no lines until we got to this point. <laughs> There it comes! Okay, almost time for the worst part of the ride. Ready? Here it comes. <laughs> well, I have to say that that was definitely the wildest ride in the wilderness! Thank you. Sorry, folks. Park's closed. Walking out of Frontierland, I've stumbled upon probably the most inconspicuous bench right here. Like, what is this even doing here? I like it though. <laughs> 22 seconds I sat on that bench for, but it felt like much longer. Big Al home. The Kiss Good Night. What? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. On behalf of every here at Magic Kingdom, we thank you for joining us today for a magical gathering of family, friends, fun, and fantasy. We hope that your magical journey with us 
has created wonderful memories that will last a lifetime. Walt Disney said that the Magic Kingdom is a world of imagination, hopes, and dreams. In this timeless land of enchantment, magic and make-believe are reborn, and fairy tales come true. The Magic Kingdom is a place for the young and the young at heart. A special place where when you wish upon a star, Until we see you again, have a safe trip home. Thank you and good night. So long, everybody. See you next week. I know that probably wasn't the best place to hear the kiss goodnight, but as soon as it started, I like froze and I stopped. I was like, oh no, kiss goodnight. And I just literally stood there and just watched. It's so magical. Literally one of my favorite things. If you end up doing a park close, just stick around to hear that once. Cause it really is magical. And I feel like that was a job well done tonight at the Magic Kingdom. I actually had a great, great night. Oh, before I go though, I did want to get a snack, like a dessert snack. And if I'm looking for a snack, which better place than the confectionery? Oh man, there are so many things to choose from. Look at this jumbo Mickey sugar cookie right here. Oh. Or they got a Mickey Mouse red short sugar cookie right there. Oh, I'm kind of torn. Ooh, what's this little striped sugar cookie down there? So many good things. I don't know. But take a look at those cake pops. There's a rose cake pop and then a Mickey cake pop. Decisions are going to have to be made. And actually, no decisions were made because I got them both. <laughs> the rose one is chocolate cake on the inside and then the Mickey one is the vanilla cake so I was like why not here's first Wow the ears were actually just marshmallows we didn't even touch the cake part yet the Mickey cake pop is gonna be hard to top but look at this Ooh. It topped the Mickey cake pop. There's like a little raspberry jelly in there too. Oh man. Now my teeth are probably all chocolate. Oh. Love the life you live. We'll see you next time. Bye.